660 if you require any more information. Now they should. Now they should. Speak now. Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome to today's game. Obviously, we moved from BBC One to BBC Two because uh, Jared Kilroy was made of balls. <laughs> oh, Georgie, here you go, quick. Wait, we're off. We're off here. Miko, don't do the team sheets. Yeah, yeah, I will do, mate. Yeah, just keep an eye on the on the pictures, Dave. So, he's and everybody. Evening all. In goal for us tonight is Sam Safehands Galatis. Number two is Jonathan Mengi. Three is Carter Hudson Doncaster. Four is Scott Bridges. Five is our captain Jack Bradshaw. Dave, turn your volume down on your phone. Don't do the team sheets. Sixteen is Tamas Amgabaduba. Seven is Devontae Sims. Eight is Ricky Case. Nine is Will McNeil. Ten is Kendall Atta Guyamfi. And eleven is James Potton. On the bench for us tonight, we've got Josh Pikerman, 14. 15 is Ace Barker. 17, Joel Mason. Number six, Tahi Janaja. And 18, Liam Etherington. I'm trying to keep an eye on the, on the pitch at the same time there. Dave's got. Name? Yeah. What did I call him? <laughs> Errington. Did I say Everington? You said Etherington. Yeah, Liam Errington. Awkward. I was just watching Dave hold a microphone and a handful of sausage. <laughs> who uh, who uh. This is a big game tonight, Mick. You're not as big as that sausage. Thank you. Oh, it's a great oh, ball through. Well Sam, ah, good boy, Sam, straight out off on his toes. Edge of the box, scoops it up. So, Stony Trafford, they're in eighth position. We are on. We are top of the league, 62 points. Stony Stratford, eighth position, 44 points. Big kick from Sam. Oh, he's gone straight through to Will McNeil. Gets an early ball in. Oh, it's left for Devonte Sims. First strike. Oh, oh yes! Yeah! Yeah! Devonte Sims. Well done. Oh my God! What a start. Ten minutes on the clock. Great what ball in from Will McNeil on the left hand side. Crosses That's it inside. inside. It gets left by somebody. It. Yep. Rolls it across. Will McNeil, I think. Oh no, someone else. Devontae yeah. Sims, right foot, smashes it into the back of the net. 1-0. Have you seen you've got the assist? I'm after spitting sausage all over the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> I know. We, for people watching, we actually ha felt we had so much time before the game kicked off. We were all chilled and relaxed, and then we realised we didn't. And it's all gone a bit tits up. We thought we had another 10 minutes. Yeah. I don't know why. Well done, Will! Oh, you'll see it come through on there in a minute. It's where Sam passed it out. Great start. It'd be interesting to see how Stoney now come back from this. They're very yeah. young looking side, aren't they? I'm glad to see Devontae get a goal. That's wicked. Somebody just let it roll. I don't know if that's. No one touched it. No. So I'll give it to Will McNeil then, that assist. Right. Yeah, Will McNeil cool. definitely with the one. assist. Will with the assist. <laughs> right, now I need to put that out on Twitter. Right. You want to take over, Dave, while I put that on, on Twitter quick? Yeah. Someone else on it. 
Well, he's down, he's trapped now, middle so of the park, number 10 on the ball. A, a nice ball in behind Jonathan Mengi. What can he do with this? Left foot cross, great ball into the middle. Oh, so the forward, rip, fucking puts out a foot and just misses it. I was trying to put him off. 32 goals in three minutes. It has been his finest. Are we allowed to do that? Ooh. And then he swallowed on his sausage there when the ball came in. Oh my God. David. As the rain comes down. Everything's not working. Let's get this screen on for you two. Now, can a bit of flick on here. Rain teeming down here this evening. Came from nowhere. Ball up the side. Referee gives a handball. So, yeah, the last time we played these before, and I don't know if anyone remembers, our avid followers may remember that this game, we were winning 3 1 with two minutes to go when all hell broke loose. And the, uh, the referee abandoned the game. We had to wait about nine weeks before we were told we'd get the points for it. Best was sent off. Do you remember Best yeah, torn into it. Wesley Snipes and killed about six people? <laughs> right. Evening, guys. Mr. Galatas again, one of our old faithful. Spiky Smith. Spiky Smith has told me he's in New Zealand watching this. It's, what was it? it's quarter to six in the morning, I think. Is that really Spiky? Over there. Anyway, the jet lag. What, what, what better way to spend the jet lag than uh, watching the AFC well from the other side of the world? We right, ball up here. Now, who's this? This is uh, Ricky Case in the middle of the park. Now. Ricky, who's playing everywhere. James and Penelope. James nearly got nursed over. Tick there. Oh, there's a free kick there, James Bra uh, Jack Bradshaw. <laughs> Should have had a camera on James there running up the steps. He, he nearly lost it. Kilroy did a Joe Mason there. <laughs> Just... <laughs> little slip. At least no one was watching, James, apart from everyone down there. <laughs> Alex Duncan's in the house, everybody. Hello, Alex. Hello. Didn't get to chat you on Saturday, Alex. How are you keeping? Have you got any score predictions for tonight, by the way, guys? It is 1-0 already to uh, AFC Well, and if you just turned on. 0-0. No, no. Great goal, boy. Uh, Devontae Sims. Mr. From Judge. Eight yards out. Right. My boy. How are you, mate? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. Well, here we go. Free kick now. It's a free kick. Um, I thought the ref had a chat with the over lino us. there. But I don't know if it's because someone with his flag. I'm not sure. Nick, you were writing on Twitter there. You don't think you've seen their chance when the ball came in. Lovely I ball. Just, yeah, I just, oh, I just saw the... Yeah. Nearly one off. Yeah. Spiky yeah. Smith's got kidney stones. He's gone to New Zealand and he's got kidney stones. Did you get them out of there or just bring them with you? I hope you got the insurance. <laughs> Did he declare them? That's the thing <laughs> over there. Did you ever watch that programme? Yeah, they throwing everything about. away over they there. They don't muck about, do they? You got a Mars bar, mate, in your pocket. <laughs> <laughs> they turn you away with an accent, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> I have got a bit of a blocked up nose. I'm, fr I'm fresh out of hospital, having a nose job. Here's a ball, he a nice ball again. And for those of you who listen to it on the radio, he looks like Daniela Westbrook now. <laughs> <laughs> ball out for a throw. That rain's horrific, isn't it? Spiker, yeah, go for it. 5-1. Right, Dan, what's that, Dan Rothwell, is it? The throw in, number two, Dan Rothwell. Ball in across the box again there, Mengi now takes Mengi. it down nice and cool. Then. There we go, Kendall. Clears it up to the Kendall. <laughs> nice, into Devontae from Case. Back to Scott Bridges. Not under a lot of pressure there, so he gets the ball out to Will McNeil. Let's go, Will. Ah, nice little overlapping run from Devontae, Devontae Sims. Plays it in. Oh, defender sticks out a leg. Well done. But he's lost it. Will McNeil. Will McNeil! Oh! I tell you what, a snapshot from Will McNeil just over Great the top effort, of the Will. <laughs> Oh, I see that going into the, the post's stamp, wasn't it? That was close. They've not gone deaf in my right ear. we got now, a Roman Dave. replay. I've already done it. No, just keeping your... Just, finished. just keeping your fair. <laughs> Just keep you on your guard. 41 people watching. Thanks, guys. Feel free to stick something in the comments there. Let us know what you think. If you're here from Stony Stratford, let comments, us know something please. about your team. Oh, here you are down the left now, Mick. He's looking for the switch. Yeah, he's found ball. it. He's found Both it. Well. Carter's got a lot of work to do it. Oh, he's cut back inside. Oh, it's a nice idea, but poor execution. It's forced Torchel's power, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. But. Well, it did set up a chance. That's another little warning there. 
another little replay for you, look, if you want to talk through what yeah. uh, George is going to zoom in and look in. That's all right, that's all right. It was a nice little, a great ball, a great crossfield ball. But, um, yeah, just couldn't get enough on that shot. Oh, Daddy, Luckily. Nathan Isherwood. Well, to win 4-2. Ishi, where are you tonight, Sandy? You're under your babysitting already. I see Ishi's little fellies that spit in the image of him. Is he? Oh, same geez. height. The ball came The ball came into the stand and the kid jumped out. He goes, Ishi! Ishi Junior! Bang! Unbelievable, look at that. Is it worth doing the starting team shoot? No. Crowd? Probably not now. Georgie, can you concentrate? Oh, loose clearance there, comes up to Will McNeil, first time header, out to Kendall, oh, defender gets into that one, it's a bit scrappy there, a Kendall, on the, Kendall on the chase there, there we go, they made a mistake, oh, and Jade Potton gets into the box, tries to lay it into Will McNeil, but the defender picks it up. This fella's good over that side, that little fella, isn't he? What number is that? Which one, Dave? The fella looks like he's oh. coming over a kinder egg. He's the one I did a picture of with Kendall last time we played him. Oh, that's right, yeah. He's a good little player, uh, to be fair, yeah. Number 15, is he? <laughs> Finn, <laughs> Finn Mahan. I, was, I thought you could say the Shire. Yeah. Like Frodo Baggins. <laughs> right, Mengi with a throw on the far side. <laughs> we haven't done that for ages. No. no. We have. Flick on from oh, James. Oh. Oh. Pop oh. with a flick on straight into the keeper's hands. Here's Sue. Get him back in that ball, guy, man, will you? She <laughs> knows her so well. Oh, Georgie. thundering again on the left-hand side of me. <laughs> right, Mengi now. Ooh, that's a naughty clash. There. Mengi's copped that square in the face. Yeah, Finn Mahan. Both players going for a header there, and there's oh, Mengi's down. Mengi caught. Mengi got the uh, the full force of that one. Right in the beak. Yeah, that looks sore. That, cool? that looks sore. <laughs> yeah, they should come out with a toy and a surprise. <laughs> Oh yeah, don't get wet. What? Don't get wet. It's not waterproof. Well, I forgot about it. <laughs> I um, forgot about you. Have we, we got no physio tonight, have we? Oh, I so don't know. Lee Merrington over I mean, there, hope. the man with the noisiest head yeah. in football. Uh, yeah, cockapoo. Just have to find a jumper. Oh, I'll just take my clothes off as well. <laughs> I'm not prepared for this club. I mean... I didn't think it was going to rain. Hey, they're my chips. Oh my God. If you rub it, a genie will come out. <laughs> right. Yeah. Maggie, is Maggie back on his feet? Is he? I can't say. I think he is. Yeah, he's le only leaning forward. He copped the full one there, didn't he? Bless him. Oh, Finn must be bleeding. He's got to. Uh, I think he's getting a new jersey. Finn Mahan. Oh my god. Oh, Maggie's still sitting down on the deck. Finn Mahan getting treated as well. It was a nasty head clash. Oh Who's the player from their side? Finn Mahan. 15. What the sub? No, he's just number 15, isn't he? Oh, no, they're the subs, ain't he? No, yeah. I'm looking at the wrong fella. I thought he was number 15. I think he's got a cut on his head. I'm sure he was wearing the 15. I think it is Finn Man. Oh, Mum, maybe a fruit suit. Either a fruit or a bottle of water, I don't really care. I'm not going to go out with my little pack on, but then no one's going to do the... Do you know how to do replays and stuff if I go? Well, I'm sure you can teach us. We need a day, we need a day around Kilroy's house, don't we? I've already fallen over twice, Sue. Look at this, this he'll need to get up. We keep dropping figures on the, on the watching. We've lost seven already since they got injured. Oh, <laughs> are they still down? Where's the physio? Are they calling her from Milton Keynes? Oh, big, big Rich. Oh, my son. Hello, Rich. How are you, Rich? How are you keeping? Oh, you miss him. We miss oh, Big Rich on the old uh, day before the fee. 
Deb, for that new viewers here, we have Deb before the feet every second Friday. Well, it should be out next Friday, which fly the wall behind the seeds. It'll be used to see Big Rich there. Yeah, I can't wait, Shady. You gotta go and give it. That's what you're here for, Rich. Yes, it is Finn. Cheers, Gary. Yeah. He's been patched up. Gary Kitchen. Alex Pitt says Stony Tier 1. How are the lads doing? Oh, that was a bad injury, man. I hope they're all right. He's getting, yeah, he's getting, Finn's getting strapped up. Where's Mingy? I think he's back in position. Rich says not bad, mate. If my nose sounds bad, I have just come out of the operating theatre. Look, I, I don't think it's straight. Did you see that? Does that look straight to you? It, it wasn't straight before. What? It's like a dog's back leg. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they could have straightened it right instead of straightening the other direction. Big Rich, super busy at work. Well, hopefully we get to see you soon, Rich. You are missed here. Well, it's a head injury, you've got to be careful, aren't you? Oh, new comment. Oh, yeah, he's a, uh, fair play to your son, he's back out. Yeah, good lad. He's back out. There's no cards there, was there? It was just accidental, no, it was, it wasn't was it? No, it was a total 50-50. Right, long throw in there by Tamas, flicks it on by uh, I don't know, Kendall trying to flick it on, comes off the defender, throw in a well. In. So good to see both Finn and Mengi recovering from that clash of heads. Well done, lads. Gary Kitchen says Finn is as hard as nails. <laughs> Mengi with the throw. Well done, Mengi. Me, 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 me. <laughs> Kendall would go flick on that went completely wrong, but Carter picks up the edge of the box. Well Carter. Comes down the side, clips one in. No, he doesn't. He puts over the bar. Hey, you, gave it, you didn't want him, you gave it to your dad. Oh, yeah. Well, you could see Jack Bradshaw back again. He's missed a couple of games. He had got a red card, which was rescinded. I don't know if you remember that game against Old Bradwell. We went down to 10 men. Cost us to lose a goal. But the FA saw a brilliant, brilliant camera walk and decided the referee needed to go to Specsavers. And uh, the red card was rescinded. Have you seen Mal? Mal Coyley's back in Lanzarote. Mal Coyley's back in Lanzarote. Oh, yeah, look at him. 31 degrees here today. God, he's a, it's a tough old tell you paper what, round Mal has. We've got, some, jet, we've got some jet setters, haven't we? We've got a few jet setters. Yeah, we're doing us. something wrong, Mick. We are, mate. We are. Mick was telling me about a great job he's doing over in Dubai. I'll be trying to... Don't say this to him, but I was hoping he was going to ask me if I wanted to go with him next time. Dubai. Mick, Mal's just left the page. <laughs> Corner kick. We take him, boy. Scotty not. boy. Scott Bridges. So from our team sheet today, I think we've got two, we've got four players who started the season with us. Would that be right? Look Sam, at that. Mengi, Sam, Carter, Carter Mengi, Ricky Case and Kendall. Kendall five. Five, yeah. five, five OGs. Well, we've got Josh as well on the bench. Josh on the bench, yeah, I'm starting, I'm saying. Yeah. Ball in. Ball in. Oh, cleared. Only as far as Devontae Sims there. Back that, to Bridges. That goal will have done. Oh, Devontae bubbled. All good. Oh, he's managed to pop one over the far post. Kendall with a header. Nope. Uh, ref seen a, a, ref seen a foul there. Will McNeil coming forward, look. That Devante, now I'll tell you, that goal will do with the world of good. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. We look up for it tonight. And yeah, if Connick can lose tonight, Mick, we go up. Is that right? Yeah. Connick can lose, we go up. Who are Connick playing tonight? I don't know. We don't, we, we're not. <laughs> we're just a flick on. Tamas. Oh, yeah, big Tamas. Your man wasn't going to get a real Tamas too Mick. easy. Mick. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go out there. James has gone go out there. You something. This is the messages tab. Yes. That's the scoreboard. Right. That's where you add goals. Yeah, okay. We're top. That's it. Mick is getting a tutorial right. here from James. Get brave. Replay. Right, throw in into the box here, Stony Strafford. Big fella there. 
It was a okay. torn on it. Those torn on it. There's a lovely ball in on a little fin at the back post there. Oh, yeah. Just okay. Just misses out on that. The last ten seconds. But he's still got possession. Plays our back. Okay. Oh, he's the corner inside. We're blocked by Mengi. Well, uh, but straight into Sam's hands. Yeah. All right, no worries. I just feel like we need another camera. All right, James. We've got Charlie Yearwood over there. Look, where is he? Yeah. <laughs> right, Sam with a big kick. <laughs> Drops. <laughs> so Scott Bridges. Bridges. Ah. Finn is now wearing number twelve. Okay, dokes. Oh, nice ball over the top there, cut out by Tamas. Tamas. Throw away at Stoudy Strafford. Oh. Where'd that come from? To the left hand side now. Oh, well cleared, Jack Bradshaw. In fact, the fin, this ball just keeps dropping at Finn's feet. Good battle in there from Devontae Sims <laughs> and Ricky Case. Or was it? Oh, sorry, James Potter there. Max! Play, play up there. Oh, ball down the line there. Great little turn, but Tamas. Oh, well oh. played. Got it slide. Great footwork. Oh, what yeah. number is that fella there? His footwork and his pace was phenomenal there. Could be an interesting battle down that he side of him. Number, number 11, is it? No, he's not 11, is he? Well, over the top. Oh, I thought that looked closer than there was. I thought Sam was going to wave it over the bar, but I thought it could have dropped in. I can't get her away at Trilling. Lovely. Cheers, Gary. Hi. Okay. <laughs> oh, he, Sam, the most underrated keeper in the yeah, Div 2. Yeah, he's, he's gone about his job. Very professional this season, isn't he? He's done a, done a really good job for us. Another big kick. Ball over the top from Case. One bounce to the keeper. Oh, that fellow's number 10, Sam. Oh, oh, we, oh, we did. He looks good. Yeah, that's a Gary Kitchen again. Look at Gary, uh, a cut of your way. Just make it. This he's fellow's hit. providing all the stats. I know. He's helping us out big time here. Well done, Bradders. Oh, oh, trying to get the early ones over the back. top, but yeah. back to the keeper. So, is she a plan to be back for the Codd game this weekend? Uh, so, he made plans for tonight. So, so plans for tonight. What he means is he was not allowed out exactly. two games in a week. Oh, ball good. falls to Kendall. Can he get a oh. turn away? He does. Keeper oh. saves with his feet. Ball cleared. Throw in well in. Yeah. I thought that was Kenny Doobie again saying Sam, are you right? No, it's just like, are you right? <laughs> Where is the ball? It's out there in Mengi's hands for a throw in. Have the lady looking to see where the ball is. Well done, Georgie. <laughs> it's now left his hands, Georgie. It's in the box. Out the box. We've got Diana Mulvani over next week for the Saturday game for the Cameras. Oh, good first touch there over Mengi's head, but... Yeah, he is the danger, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well read by Bradders there. Scoop clears it away. Ball out for a throw into Stoney Stratford. Are you able to zoom in on that now? What's happened now? <coughs> no, I'm just saying, are you able to zoom in and out on it because it's a bit fair looking? I'm coming back because it's raining anyway, so I'll sort of zoom out. Are you able to zoom in and out? Right, so ball breaks to Will McNeil in the... Just at the halfway line, a few players on him, nice little turn, finds Casey with his back to goal, turns, gets the ball out to Kendall on the left hand side. Let's go Kendall. Takes it on, takes him on, hey? And offside. then the flag's gone up eventually for offside. Could have saved. He's it a few times the last couple of games, hasn't he? Yeah. Racing across the line, yeah. Kendall. Why? Go on, go and have a break then. I'll call you if I need you. As it's raining, I'm not understanding like a spare part anyway. <laughs> Sam. Oh, Sam. Oh, Sam. Well done. Every time. He gets the ball up. Kendall there. Got some pace up that top there, haven't they? Will McNeil tracking back. Well done. 
The time has set the back is super quick, the Audi. Oh, oh well, well done. Lovely free. stuff. Nixos defender. Give it to him. Oh, great right ball. Defender. Can he finish? Yes, yes he can. Kendall and Giaffi again scores. And Will McNeil again with another assist. assist. That's great play, lads. Will McNeil up the left hand side. He waits and waits up before he can play the perfect pass into Kendall and Giaffi. Kendall on his left foot scores again. I think this is the fourth or fifth game in a row Kendall scored. Fantastic stuff, lads. 2-0. AFC Welland 2. Stoudy Strafford 0. About 20 minutes out there. That that is... Lovely footwork from Will. The defender was closing him down. A little 1-2. Uh, puts it past him. And Kendall haven't just been offside. He don't yeah. have to, to hold the line there. And it was a because... Yeah. And it was a very clever ball from Will down the outside of the defender. I think he was expecting to be put inside him. Um, and a quality finish from Kendall. Easy. Easy. <laughs> We want six. We want six. Uh, Gary Kitchen says Sam scored 21. So this is their number 10. He scored 21 in the league this season. And given we couldn't buy a goal through September and November, he's done very well. <laughs> Gary Kitchen says great finish. Michael Ishwood, great goal. Mr. Galatis, yes. <laughs> oh, good tackle there by um, James Potton. Maggie tries to cut it inside, plays a nice ball there to uh, Sims. Oh no, it was Kendall, it was. Lewis are very bad there. <laughs> up you go, Jack. Well up, Jack, Bradshaw. Scott Bridges, the character. Playing nice football now. Ball over the top, tries to find Kendall, but the defender gets in front, gets ahead, and goes out for a throw to Well. All our threat is down this side. Carter goes to ground, wins the ball, but it's moved back by the nine. Here's Ricky Case. Go on, Casey, boy. Oh, Go on, Casey. Snake hips. Oh, Casey. Oh, we keep it spilled it. Kendall on the rebound. Oh, oh. Kendall. Jesus, he was nearly on it there for the second goal of the night. But Ricky Case, go back in the years, back to the 80s for a case. Great little run. Two hips. Ick, ick. Smashes the ball. Good save with the keeper. Kendall. <laughs> Unlucky. Who scored our first goal to get off the goal? Uh, Devon save. Oh, yeah. 38 people watching. Anyone that has just tuned in, it's AFC Well and 2. It's Tony Shafford. Yeah. I think we do have that on the scoreboard, don't we? It's on the page, is it? James on top of it, as usual. Do a great job, James Kilroy. High ball in now to the box. Flick on again, boy. Who else but Kendall? I tell you, Kendall must have been doing out of 10 headers. Goalkeeper looks very young. Maggie takes that ball down nicely out of the air. Plays a ball in over the top, tries to find uh, James Potton, but too much on that and back to the keeper. Lewis Crowder, come on boys, there's another man not allowed out after getting married. He's <laughs> on his honeymoon. Oh is he, where is he? Surely his honeymoon's got to be in Welling. Barcelona, I think. Oh, there's a lovely body behind. Ball. This is the one they've been trying. He's cut back inside again. And then he's gone back outside. Gets oh, a shot, well Carter blocked. blocks it, well done. Not only as far as into the box, and then... The referee's given something, doesn't I don't he? know what he's, he was given there. But Carter's down. Yeah, Carter's doing his downward dog impression. Did a bit of yoga. He's all right. Carter does go down a lot, doesn't he? Uh, look at him. He's all right. Look at him. Nothing wrong with him. Referee. Have a ward. Lewis Croucher just just tuned in from Barca. Ah, who, oh, who scored? Did you tell him he scored? No. Oh. Lewis, we had um, Devonto Sims at the first and Kendall the second. Two assists from Will McNeil. Big kick. Oh, James Potter with the lovely flick on. Are you going to the, see the stadium with your there, Lewis? Oh, Potter with an early shot. Oh, that Ooh. was close. What a strike. That was oh, close. James Potter with a first time turn and shot for about 25, 30 yards, just past the post. 
in total control at the minute. Oh, definitely, yeah. We just Stop need to maintain this, don't we? They've had chances. Yeah. Two's always a dodge. He's got a ball falls to Case, edge of the box, pops one over Lonely. to Will McNeil. Oh, oh Will! Tries a is that going for throw? Please go for throw. Oh. Will! He tried to go for the spectacular volley. He's just gone out for a goal <laughs> kick. <laughs> Dave, on a ward, will you? <laughs> Can't play for time already. Yeah. He's feeling the pressure because all his teammates. Lewis Croucher says Will McNeil is his favourite player. Well, he's in shock that Kendall scored. <laughs> Big kick from the keeper. Bradder screams for that one and wins it. Comes straight back down. Kendall, little flick on. Oh, Will oh, couldn't get it. Oh. Casey was very nearly through then. Ricky's sniffing goal tonight. Yeah. Ricky's desperate for one, isn't he? He's got a great header the other day, didn't he? Saturday. Good oh, pressing, Will. good pressing. That's it, get it on him. No turn allowed there from McNeil and Case. Will with Carter the socks the down. Oh, he's so tried Jack to clear Green's it, look. but it's gone as far as James Potter, who puts the ball down the right-hand side for Kendall to chase. Defender gets it. Oh, he's done well there to get that, that touch there, that lad. Oh, well done, Finn. Finn. Finn's my favourite player for them. Is that because it's the only one you know and you can recognise him because you've got a bandage on? Well, it sounds like he's Irish as well, Finn. Finn Mann. Front of the Oh, Kendall, he's gone round him. Strength there, he's gone past two of them and then just for fun gone back and done oh, them both lovely. again. <gasps> oh, James Potter with a volley. Did one of them flick behind the back, was it? No, just, no a re replay, just, just, just a regular volley. Just a regular one. Was it not? Oh no, he just crossed on the left. Yeah, just a regular volley. <laughs> Step seven, Harrison. <laughs> he said I thought it was a Rabona. Ramona. Mara Ramona. Charlie Hallam, 2 0. Go on, the boys. What's your excuse for not being here, Charlie? He's only on from a broken leg. <laughs> Lewis, Casey's great header from an even better deliverer. Who delivered the ball Saturday for Casey? I can't remember. Was it? You sure? I can't remember. Oh. <laughs> Come on, lads. Christ, I'm wasted here. I'm gonna get a real I'm gonna get a rail Bedford. <laughs> right, I'm all in on Finn Mahan. Four point five million, we should put our bid in now, shouldn't we, Astro? I'm all in on Finn Mahan. Celtic Scottish Good header. Celtic Bradders. fan. Scott Bridges. Good pressing, good pressing. That's the danger man here, the Ted. He swaps Sam, eyes, does he? Sam, oh, you dear. He's not happy. He's not happy with his teammates. No. What's the ball look quicker? Who was the one that Gary was saying scored? Um, this fella here, this number here. 10, Sam. Sam. <laughs> yeah, Charlie, Will oh, McNeil on fire as usual. Carter. Out to Will McNeil, oh, first touch past the defender. Oh, oh. Poxy posting me way. I tell you what, they're under a lot of pressure here. The boys are putting in one hell of a shift. Carter with the header down, straight to Will McNeil. What can he do here? Carter's doing well too, would he? Oh, oh, nice little flick will. on from Will. Oh, Kendall tried to play it back out to Carter, but defender read it. It's not going out. It's not going out. Over the top. Oh, yeah, it's kind of. Yeah, so yeah. Uh, Stoney Stratford throw. Oh, a bit of shit. Hills really there from Bridges. I'd like to see. <laughs> They just can't get the ball here, can no, they? he thought we were playing, Dave. That was coming to us. Are the three of us named now? We've all signed up as players, haven't we? I have. I have. We've had my registration through. should have your registration. Oh, you should have your registration revoked, David. <laughs> It'll be immigration revoked. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see Dave on the pitch. Right. Over in one hand. Here's Will again. Yeah, after a little flick on from Kendall, sends him oh, out lovely. there. Ball in. <gasps> oh no, the defender was in two minds there. It's bounced off him. Kendall caught by surprise. Couldn't do much with it, but again, short ball out. Devonte putting him under pressure. They're trying to play out from the back, but it's not working. Will McNeil picks the ball up now. Back to Carter. Bridge is under pressure, but he's put a, ball, a lovely ball down there for Will McNeil. Oh, his first touch lets him down. Second touch. Ah, it comes out Get for in a on that line Absolutely. has gone it's further and further in, yeah, 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 I know. With the hard day. There we go, the oh, Hollywood ball, ball out to Mengi. Gets his first touch for a while. He's probably getting cold over there. Nice footwork, Mengi. Plays it back to Bridges. He puts one down the line to James Potton. Nice touch and turn. James has been a good addition, hasn't yeah, he? Yeah, he looks solid up there, doesn't he? Oh, nice ball back out, but unlucky there. 
ball out for a Stony Stratford throw. I've got 33 minutes gone, but we put it about three minutes down there for the injury, so about half hour gone. 2-0 to the 41 Romans. 41 people watching. Come on, everybody. There's no decent games on tonight. Get on to this. PSG and Barcelona. Northern on this. Big ball over there for Will McNeil to chase. It's got a defender on his back. Two of them. Two of them now, yeah. Can we shoot? Well done. Ball back in to Scotty Bridges. taking a bobble. Joe Mason won't agree. He's <laughs> done well to keep Joe hold of that. Will agree. <laughs> oh, Will to Carter. Nice. Plays it across. Defender meets. Go on, Scotty. Scotty Bridges on the press. Straight Get away. Good press well, in there. Well, well done. Absolutely dominant performance is, so yeah, far. This has been a good, uh, good pass. Really, really play. good. Really good. Back to Sam. Keep it simple, Sam. Good lad. Takes a touch. Plays it out to Ming on the right hand side. Under pressure straight away. Does well. Gets inside the defender. Oh, bit messy. He lost that himself. He lost it out, yeah. <clears throat> so Stratford on the, on the break forward. Oh. Oh. It just sums it up for the last 10 minutes. They've not had a chance in this half of the pitch. They did get it and it falls apart. Uh, there's two lads who flood their, uh, get the lose the kill with, yeah. their, with their lads. Michael Ishii would say Will has been excellent yeah. again. Yeah, it's been absolutely phenomenal. Charlie Halman, Will McNeil for you. I wonder if we'll be able to hold on to Will McNeil. That's the question there, wasn't it? Oh, of course he'll want to stay. Why? You get me and you. Why well, don't want to stay? Because his mum and dad love us. Us three. <laughs> They might get a burger, chips, programme and a drink. Why would you want to go? The burgers are Ball nice. up, pot on with a flick on. Back to Bridges, back to Bradshaw. Looks for that ball, oh, fizzes one over the top. There's Finn there to clear, does, does well actually. Oh, James Potter oh, battling. Played. Oh, good tackle, Mengi. That's all right, that's Yeah, all right. no, Mengi was all right. Oh, Will, first touch. Oh, you can see what he's trying to do there, but... Kendall's strength gets the ball back. Well done to Carter, who's shown support. Carter there to Will, who's onside. Oh, takes it down it's to the, the line. line. Gets it across. Gets it! It's another goal! It's Kendall the Will McNeil and Kendall show tonight, everybody. On a goal, Will McNeil down the left-hand side again, as he always does, crosses the ball in, and on a play for Kendall and Gianfi. I'll tell you one thing, Kendall and Gianfi will be buying him a pint tonight in the bar afterwards. I'm running out of room on my book when I'm Actually, doing this. Actually, I think Will's only 17, so he can't even have a pint. Oh, He's going to be one hell of a, a pack of kips. Be one, a pack of what? A pack of kips. <laughs> <laughs> He'll need a kip after this. <laughs> so in their defence. Could nearly have a salt there. Probably have a, oh, probably have a little fruit shoot, it's bless him. Blow, blood stuck up my nose. It's got to be head. <laughs> Oh, great stuff. Like Miss Galatis, <laughs> she's on fire. Nathan Isha and Will is going to go far. She'll be playing much higher. Shut up, is she, will you? <laughs> trying to keep me here, for God's sake. Charlie Hannum, Will, will is unplayable. Right, that's it. How are we going to keep Will? Huh? What are we going to do? Duck tape. Have you, have you got anything on him? Can somebody go through, James? Can you go through his search history? See if we can get something on him. Duct tape and a bit of rope, and oh. we'll keep him. It's fine. Keep him in the um, oh, we'll in the changing room. Just feeding fish heads during the week. <laughs> oh, well done, Kendall. Well, in three, Stony Stratford nil. And what is a one-sided game? Totally. Will McNeil again down the left hand. So it sounds like the Will McNeil fan club here. Carter. Oh, look at this, Kendall's on fire as well. Kendall's confidence is through the roof. And if you're a good striker and you get the ball into you, you're going to score goals. Definitely. Will's made it very easy for Kendall tonight, yeah. hasn't he? Oh, Scotty Bridge as well in. Oh, are we saying this is the, the half of the season so far? I mean... We've very good, yeah, haven't we? Yeah, it's the most complete performance I think I've seen so far. There's... If they keep doing what they're doing, there could be a lot of goals in this, unless Stoney can sort themselves out a little bit, but they're definitely there for the taking. Do you know what? Our first two games of the season, 8-1 and 6-1, weren't they? And after that, there's been a lot of struggle, but some half-decent performances, some very good performances, some very poor performances, but tonight we seem to, to we're on form tonight. 
We've got a good mix of experience and youth. If we keep playing like this, they're going to need new commentators because we're not doing them justice. There's Will McNeil again inside. Ricky Case plays a back. Oh. Bridges, he fancies one surely. No. Casey's desperate. Plays it out of snake hips. He's desperate for one, isn't he? Yeah. Clips a nice ball over. Is oh. that a shot? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can't he have won one in a train? Oh, that must have been an early kickoff, was it? So he won't go up tonight. Right. Old Bradwell beating New Bradwell 3 1. Old Bradwell versus New Bradwell. So what is the difference between them? They should amalgamate. Cannington have beaten Aston Clinton 6-1. It's Cannington battles twice as well. I know. They're some team there, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> hey. 43 people watching. Let's try and get up you to know, the 50. That's, that's Will's family telling each, everyone else, get, oh, back, so get on there and watch this. It's all the agents. Thing. It might be all the <laughs> agents watching. <laughs> The um, I forget what I was going to say there. So a free kick. Right, so Picard is going to take this one. No doubt it's going to be popped to the far post. Will McNeil been told to go back and defend for a bit, probably to give Stoney Stratford a chance. I'll tell you one thing. So this fellow put 21 goals. He must be top of the season. I know. That's, I think that must be the uh, top scorer this season but Kendall's I think he's on 9 now I think there's, an, there's another fella for Bovey there's another fella for Bovey as well who's How's up that? there Carter Ray swings Barlin. it in oh, oh good header no! oh who's was the header the header was James Potton and I think after line was uh, Tamas straight at the keeper it's a ball out for a corner is that Kendall Kendall's not taking a corner is he no, no of course no. he's not. He's winding him up. They're leaving it for Scotty Bridges. Scotty's got a great delivery, Levy. Well, I probably was used to was taken out. Uh, apparently, uh, Scotty Bridges is the penalty taker now, isn't he? Yeah. Should we get one? Bradis wants to score, that's why. He wants a header. Carter making an early Carter, run in the box. Ball to go back, in. Will you? Ball whipped in. Keeper punches oh, it. Oh, Only for case. It's Case! Oh. Oh. Case just... He hit it as hard as he could as well. <laughs> just reached the end line, the goal line before. From two yards out and it bubbled nine times. The ball just fainted with the power. <laughs> Changed shape as well, I believe. Uh, it did look like a rugby ball. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Jack Allen at Bovington. It, yeah. Who's was this guy in the kitchen? Can we get him on the books? This fella knows everything. Well, I'm with you. He can be telling us, I'm sure it's anything. We fall for it. <laughs> Right, throw on the halfway line to Stony Stratford, unless Gary thinks different. Yeah, tell us what you think, Gary. <laughs> well, actually, I think you'll find. <laughs> Only joking, Gaz. Ooh, oh, good boy, meaty Finn challenge there. Oh, he's up again, Finn. Finn good and Finn. there again. <laughs> when Finn started this match, he was six foot two. And he had eight pints of blood in him, but yeah. <laughs> Ball crossed in, met by Tamas. Oh, he's got a shield. Oh, oh. Bradders. Is that Bradders? Yeah, that? it was Bradders, yeah. And no, that was Carter. Carter. Carter, it's Carter right, ball up to, down. Yeah, that's why I thought it was yeah, Carter. Yeah, I'm surprised. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's trying to, trying to make something happen, bless yeah. him. Good player. Oh, goes for that switch again. Oh, oh lucky. Oh, Sam. I feel sorry for Sam. Just number two, Dan Rothwell. <laughs> no, yeah. Sam has played a shot to, Casey. To, to save the game no. and a half now, was he? Again, he's had two or three early balls over there and he's been alert on his yeah. toes, come picked him up, no drama. Into Case, out to McNeil. Ooh, first touch. He still has it. Ah, see, that's how good he is. His first oh, touch Will's was brilliant. got him again. He's gone past him on the touch, like he's not there. Squares it. Kendall, oh, flick on. Again. Oh, defender got to oh, it. It's going to fall to Devonte. Hit it! <laughs> oh, oh, James Potton just couldn't get it. He's got up there. Lovely but play again, Scott Bridges will. slows it down and breaks it up. Back to James Potter, a nice ball through, oh, Kendall's outside. Oh, unlucky. Oh, <laughs> oh, Gary, look, Gary said it's only because I'm sat here with a laptop open. Oh. What else are you looking at, Gary? <laughs> you dirty boy. <laughs> <laughs> Has he got incognito on another page? 
<laughs> Who's he play for? <laughs> Is he that Italian fella? Hoy ball. Tamas. Stony Strafford trying to hold on to the ball for a little bit. Oh, no, 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 he's, he's, given not, it. he's on. It's just this number 10, the danger yeah. man it is, isn't it, Sam? Gets a oh, deep ball, ball to the far side, but there's Carter yeah. to head it away to Will McNeil. Oh, first time. Filthy oh. ball, Willem. William. Willem. 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 Will I am. <laughs> <laughs> nice play there between the 7 and the 11. Back out to little Finn. So Kendall was wearing the nine, was he not? Great ball through, but again, too much on it, hey? It was Kendall wearing the nine. I thought Kendall was always nine, was he not? Kendall? Yeah. No, I think he's it's always normally 10, been 10 or 11. Was he? Oh, he's ask Gary. Ask Gary. Gary. <laughs> <laughs> Right, ball over the top of Kendall to run on, so he's not offside. Oh, he's not offside, but the ball. We're in too the 45th it. minute. It's going to be a few, though, because of that injury, isn't there? Yeah. <laughs> ball up. Oh, Tamas reads the danger straight onto, onto their danger man. Plays it back. Keep looking for the return ball, but Bradders is there, is he? Great challenge yeah, from Bradders. Bradders loves them. Solid. He loves them ones, tackle, doesn't he? Doesn't he? Yeah, really causes problems. What, the floodlight? Yeah, the one in the middle. Yeah, it is shocking, yeah. Stop that there, 45. It's Downey now coming again to try and play in the tail. A nice early ball from Broken Bridges out again. to Will McNeil. Here he goes on another run. Look, they're all back for him. Yeah, all loads all on him. He's got, no, he's got no support there, so he's going to have to okay. come back to Carter. Good lad. But he's drawn three players over there. Back to Bridges. A lovely football. Ball across to Mengi. He's got the number 10 all over him there. Oh, oh he's lost ten. it there. Fair play. Free kick. Free kick, Stoney. I think Mengi had to give that one there, didn't he? Is he not going to get the book, uh, is he? A poor old Mengi. He's the only one. Like, the ten, their 10 looks like he's the only fella that can do, aren't they? Yeah. Mengi's stuck in the wall, now. <laughs> Although, to be fair, little Finn has been decent here. Yeah. And this number two shown a lot over this side. So Don Rothwell. Mark Alicia had great first half, especially from Willem. <laughs> yeah. Don't say that now, like me, we'll end up getting another... We need to get Mike Alicia on the comms, because... We'll end up getting points... We'll, we'll, get, we'll get points taken off us now for a wrong player's name, won't we? We could do. <laughs> that saga went on forever, didn't it? Yeah. Lewis Croucher, Lewis Ellis. I still don't understand it. It was just um, clutching at straws from a certain team, wasn't it? Yeah. Which hasn't worked in their favour at all. Too late, okay. Not the no, line up. Right on linesman. Players yeah. offside. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, it's okay. It's all right, Harrison. <laughs> James is one of them like neighbours, isn't he? If the kids play football out the front, he's waiting for that ball to go in his garden so he can nick it. Cheers, mate. They know who it is. Someone's daughter is having it. Carly's cousin, I think. Oh, right. Ball up from Bradders. Oh, Kendall, Kendall got a head. Look at that. He flicked it on. Keeper screamed for it, and the defenders just walloped it away. Header back from Bradders straight into Sam's. Sam's size 10, Sondico's, whatever he's got on. Can't see from here. He's taken a few touches because he's had nothing to do he's this half. He didn't have a save to make on Saturday. He hasn't no. had a save to make this half. No, we've, we've, we've looked solid. But you just know he's there to pull out a, a suit of a world he saved if you need him, doesn't he? Yeah. Ball up. Will goes for the header. Oh no, he's missed the bounce. Oh, Pot James Potter was going for Fancy a worldie that. there. Oh, that's oh, okay. no, the spin Definitely took spins. it right away from Finn. Spin Here comes from Snake Finn. Hips. Nice ball Bridges out. Bridges has scored it, just looks, uh, uh, slapping uh, the ball yeah, the way the, the right, Yeah, with the way the pitch is and the, and the rain. What a ball out. Will McNeil sticks right to the far post. Oh, what a good clearance. Out to the edge of the box. And a big hoof. Straight for downtown, Mrs. Pipe. Brad is back to Sam. Yeah, 
There you go, ball out. There's Bradders. There can't be long left now for this half. Brad is looking for that ball to put him under pressure. He's not letting him up. Oh, lucky he goes out for a goal kick. When's our next game? Saturday. Who are we playing Saturday? Saturday? We've got Codica Saturday. Codica Saturday. <coughs> oh, the windy, the that was windy a cool game field. Last time, wasn't it? Second half was great, wasn't we? Bet them 3 2, didn't we? That was brutal, that weather, though. Oh, well, we, do, we, we put them away on Saturday. That's the league over. Well, as in, we go up. Thomas. Thomas. Oh, hello. Yeah, man, he's itching to get on oh, the ball. He's a, he's a handful, isn't it? An absolute handful. He's got yeah. it. He's going to hit this left shot away. Oh, oh Sam, Sam just gets I mean? fingers on it. Good old yeah, Sammy boy. He's do all game, and then he pulls out a save like that. It's such a solid keeper. Let's have a look at this. It, it looks like... He's... I don't think yeah, he's caught that as clean as he'd like, but it's a good, it's still a decent strike. Sam. If that fella gets a shot away, I think yeah. it's Sam Lovers will cut ill. So a corner to Stoney, be, it would be really annoying to concede the goal now. Sticks it over deep. Oh, blocks, I can't see who's blocking what. That's good at him. Casey, is that getting our way? Oh, James Potter. Ah, oh, Kendall touches it. Takes it down for Will McNeil. First touch, great. A little one to him and Kendall. Oh, Will, he's got it, he's got it. No, oh, not. defender just to sh swap just to, there. I'll tell you what, I didn't think he was that quick, Will. Oh, he's coming back this way. It's ever since he dropped that eye from his name, he made him quick on the back of his shirt, didn't it? Yeah, we'll there we go. The print does the change. That, <laughs> that's Half a great first half pick. What do you reckon? Yeah, very good first half. All over the pitch, we've been excellent, haven't we? Yeah. But Carter at the back has been playing. Yeah, down this side, doesn't it? Carter at the wheel to Kendall. It's just been fantastic. Be solid. Stuff. Scotty Bridges in the middle, splashing the ball left and right. Great to see Devontae scored his, yeah. that's his first goal for the club as well, isn't it? I tell you what, it's, it, like we said, it's probably the most complete performance I've seen this season. Um, totally dominated that. Yeah, fantastic. Right, I'm going for a little impressed. walk, yeah, are you? I'm going, to, I'm going to go for a, yep. Yeah. Right, guys, listen, come back and join us. It's not over There's yet. There's definitely more goals in the second half. Right, let's roll. I look fat in this. <laughs> <laughs> you still need to walk off with the headphones on. <laughs> right, let me just put it quick. Down. Yeah, I was going to put it on Twitter quick. <laughs> And I will endeavour somewhere to put a little video on. Is that three now? We at KCHR Accounts and CEO have over 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and pay off services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services. From upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project, to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home, we will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We're KCHR Accounts and CEO over 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and pay off services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services. From upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project, to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home, we will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. 
please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We at HR Accounts and CEO have 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services. From upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home, we will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We're Case HR Accounts and CEO have 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services. From upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home, we will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We're Case HR Accounts and CEO have 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services. From upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home, we will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We're Case HR Accounts and CEO have 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services. From upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home, we will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We're Case HR Accounts and CEO have 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services. From upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home, 
we will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We at KCHR Accountancy have over 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services, from upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home. We will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We at KCHR Accountancy have over 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services, from upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home. We will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We at KCHR Accountancy have over 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services, from upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home. We will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We at KCHR Accountancy have over 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services, from upgrading or creating you a new driveway or garden project to building you an extension outhouse or refurbing your whole home. We will ensure that together we find the perfect solution to suit your construction needs. Please contact us today for a no obligation site visit and a quote from one of our team. No job is too big or small. Let us help you make your dream home come true. We at KCHR Accountancy have over 15 years experience specialising in limited company accounts, sole traders, partnership, back returns and payroll services. We're based in Stevenage Old Town. Please call us on 01438 367 660 if you require any more information. At Glancy Construction, we're proud to provide a full range of building services, from upgrading or creating a new driveway and garden. Hey, 
Well, ladies and gents, I'm just going to, if anybody's still watching, I'm sure you're very bored of that video on loop. So I'm going to play some replays for you. Oh, they're in reverse order. <laughs> Let me just go down to the bottom. Start at the bottom. Not that one. That was a test. That was also a test. <laughs> Here we go. First goal, Devontae Sims. Buries it in the bottom left corner. Great ball from Will. Stoning probably could have done better with that. They looked like they were watching a bit. And what have we got here? Oh, that was a nice shot from Will. Just over the bar. Chance for Stony Stratford. Well, players are coming back out onto the pitch. So, let's get ready. No one's here, though, from the commentary team, as usual. So you got me for a minute, trying to do the camera and the microphone and everything else. Let's get the scoreboard up. I have actually reset the clock this time though. There we go. Well, I hope you enjoyed that first half. Michael's finishing a burger. Let's hope the ref doesn't blow the whistle because I can't commentate and do a camera. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, players back out onto the pitch for the second half. Really? We've got, we've got. Just in case you didn't see that, Charlie. <laughs> no change. I don't know if we've had any substitutions. Someone gives away if we've had any subs. <laughs> Adam Sparshot, who's in the crowd, has put a comment on. Thank you, Adam. Watching online and in person, that is dedication. <laughs> What's his comment say? Great first half. Saturday away to Codica is lining up to be the match where Welling can win their first promotion. You are spot on, my friend. Where are you? I can't see my glasses on if I look up from the screen. <laughs> He's probably sitting right next to me, and I can't see him. <laughs> I'm kind of positioning the microphone sort of in front of Mike. So you might be able to hear him. You've got a dog? Oh yeah, funny enough. <laughs> <coughs> Any comments? Adam Spasha. I've just done it. Adam's here, isn't he? Yeah. Are you still here? Dave always comes back and repeats <coughs> everything I've just said. What did you say? <laughs> Adam Sparshot's here. <laughs> and he's put a comment in. He's a super fan. He is an absolute legend of a fan. And he does our stats. Lads are keeping them busy with the stats now, with the mm. goals banging in, aren't they? Ask him how many goals Kendall scored now. I thought it was... Yeah, Adam, are you listening to this? How many goals has Kendall got, do you think? I think it must be 20 now. Right, we're back. Sony bars. <laughs> Hands off my sausage. <laughs> <laughs> Who's is that? Sorry, what are you doing? Huh? How are you coming you're getting the bath of sausages delivered? Because Lisa said she's making them, I said I'll have one. That's not a microphone, that is my sausage. Good bite? challenge. Can I work back? I'm going to look down, you and Dave would be at one at each end, wouldn't you? <laughs> no. But Lady in the Tramp. Uh, as long as I'm the lady. <laughs> right, let me try and log back in here. Oh, all right. Free kick to Stoney, given away by James Potton. Hey, can you feed me my chips while I'm on the camera? No. Right, 32 people are watching. 
Let's see if we can get this up. I think the most we've had on the commentary so far has been 140 this season. That's it, 160, was it? Yeah. I don't know what happened since then. Sorry, I'm just a bit off-put by Lisa looking up and smiling when she saw the sausage that she put down. I'm wondering if she stitched me up. Oh, she stitched. Yeah. She is hanging around. James Potton ball over the top to Kendall. Kendall chest it down. Oh, great overlapping run from Devonte. Put Kendall puts it right into his path. Ah. Oh, Devontae's just it looked like he was holding his hammer. Yeah. Oh, he wins it back. Gets across in. Oh, defender at the front, front post picks <coughs> it up. Over the top for Mengi to challenge. No turn, no turn. Good work with our Mengi. We're back into Mengi. Doing again, that crossfield ball. Yeah, Sam out like a little greyhound, look at him. So I was talking to Sam on Saturday, and he said that this run, uh, getting this run of games now has really helped his confidence. And he actually now feels like he's part of the team, which, to you know what? He's been part of the same all season, he's been playing it, hasn't he? I'm trying to tell him that. He has, yeah. Just shows what a, a good run, a bit of confidence can do with somebody. Uh, Big Rich says Will is the best player on the pitch think the right back might need counselling after the game been saying that for months that boy has a huge future he has been saying that oh look I nearly fell for it we've got one where's the comments gone we've got a, 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 a Kenny the Dad special it's not there yet on our screen unlucky well, son <laughs> 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 That's because we were talking about your sausage, Mike. June Errington, another <laughs> great first half. Well done, lads. I'm enjoying watching from home. Great stuff, June. And that is Mrs. Errington. I wonder why you were looking and smiling. I thought you'd stitch me up. Is that? June, if you're listening, can you tell us what products Slaby uses in this hair? You've got the nicest hair in football. Can she take a picture of you? As voted by the um, supporters. I'm making sure it's cooked all the way through while I'm eating it. Oh, he's balling on the left-hand side now. Who's this on it? I can't even see over there. Who was that? Have we had any subs this half now? No. I'm kind of missing not seeing Will over this side. <laughs> yeah, some first half he had there. Yeah, I must speak about Lemo. He's doing a good job, hasn't he? He's taking over. I know Big Rich is listening here, so... You know, watch what I'm saying. What you're saying, David. Big Rich has taken, it, taken us to the top of the table, and he must kept us here. Yeah. So, a great team effort all round. Well put, David. Well put. And Richard has kept on top of the pitch as well. Oh, did Rich do the pitch? I don't know. <laughs> I think Joe Mason might have a word to say about that. I think there's more goals at this game, definitely. Yeah, us, yeah. it should be. Joe if we the want them. <laughs> With Devante the there in the middle of the park. Joe again. whack a mole Mason. Devante's had a good game. He looks like one of them little pops out, I'm just over here making myself a um, noise. Kenny the dad, you got to do better than that, son. <laughs> so, by sitting back there, rack, racking his head, what can, how can we get these? Go, you can never get us. Never. Three to one, Dave gets done at least once before the end of this game. <laughs> Probably. <Yeah. laughs> the ball right, over the top right. of Kendall. <laughs> Clear with the centre half there. The Miggy. Miggy's played well as well. He hasn't played for a while, Miggy. That's a great ball now, it's not. <laughs> the one day. Back to Bradders, Bradders plays a high ball down the left hand side, so clear by the defender. Carter again, nice Carter so that, good. Oh, the ball just stuck from there. Oh, good ball in by Carter, but too close to the keeper, collects it. Looks to play a quick ball out, but the lads are putting up that high press. Ah, oh, Bridge is well in again. And, well done. I thought Don't let Mingy take it. Foul throw. <laughs> June Errington, nothing special, just head and shoulders, a bit of Vaseline, and he never brushes his hair. Oh, Vaseline <laughs> in your hair? <laughs> oh, he must think. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see him coming, to, getting in the car, and the pillow stuck to his head. 
<laughs> Two kids and a lollipop. Yeah. Is that why he sleeps in the man cave, June? <laughs> Big throw from Tamas. Michael, have you seen the man cave? I yeah. have, yeah. Yeah, he's seen it. Him and Ricky have been seen the man cave. We don't see nothing, me. Did you use the urinal? I, I did, yeah. <laughs> I really want to know about that. <laughs> what, me using the urinal? Or? No. He got, well, he's got a urinal in the man cave. Just on the outskirts. On the fence. <laughs> Roy Keeper, now there won't be his last kick out of the half. Hoy ball up, who's under the... Mengi tries to win that. Jumps like a fish, a flat fish. Look at this now. On the break. I tell you what he else, so he's got a bit of space. Oh, oh, 11, it? 11 ghosts in. Oh, no. Shotgun effort. Yeah. Big Rich again, 25 games, had us top four. Just finished a good job off. Bovington is a threat. Need to win every game to be certain. The three points we got robbed off, robbed off for Connecticut was a joke. And that is that really has kept everyone else in it, hasn't it? Then three points. Yeah. Anyone that doesn't know, we did play. What was it? Go on, you explain to me. I'm tired of that saga. What's that? The Codica game. Yeah. So we played about. We played about what? 75, eight, about 75 minutes. We're two 0 up. Completely dominated the game. And we've made a change, and there was a slight error on the sh on the team sheet. Go on, um, Thomas. Go on, Thomas. Oh, shut the Oh, yeah, as well. oh, yeah, a slight well error. Well, that fella's a danger man, Sam. Yeah, slight error on the team sheet, and Connacut were all over it. We ended up winning the game two-one, and they decided to make a complaint because they thought we played an ineligible player, despite but, the fact that we we're two 0 up and finished it two-one. But do you know what happened? We did play an ineligible player. He was signed on with the FA, but he wasn't signed on with the league. But he we had come through but, in the Christmas post. So we deserved. But we had points. emails to say that he signed on and we had the FA. So to we play. didn't deserve the three points. Yeah, we did. We smashed the shit out of them. They're embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Quite frankly. Oh. They were embarrassing. Oh. Casey with the last ball out there. Candle on the run. Can he keep it in? No. Nope. No, because yeah. It, oh, sorry. He kept a bit better there. <laughs> And Nathan Nishwa yeah. said, not getting the points for the four Stony Strafford game was a joke as well. Did yeah. we not get the points for we that? Did. We did get we did the points. did eventually, yeah. It just took about three months. To yeah, it took a long time, but we did get the points. Yeah, I know Best had, he knocked two of them out inside the second round, didn't he? And Best then, the sub, there's said something afterwards, he knocked him out with a right, right hand and a left kick. Yeah, Kendall. Here comes oh, Bridges. Bridges. Drills it. Oh, oh Bridges on the beast post. On toast. Unlucky. That's our Welshie next to me there. That's what Welshie <laughs> yeah. says. Mengi, nice ball in, clear by the defender, but only oh. fast it. Ah, Devante. Good challenge. Mengi's spending a lot of time on the floor. They're having a little chat to each other. Well, Tamas, here's the 10 again, the danger man, but he's on his Tamas, own. Well, oh, done. well done, Tamas. There's Mr. Reliable Carter. Who are we looking for? Play of the season, guys. Just go on, we're going to have the picks around. Who are you thinking? Kendall for me. Uh, Kendall for me, too. Mick? Mick's on Casey. Yeah, yeah Mick's all over. Casey's, Casey's got top scorer, yeah. young player. Yeah, player's okay, player. Yeah. He's got everything yeah. for me. Of course, it's a great battle, these two here. Yeah. Tamas, Tamas sees it out. Tamas is telling, he's still doing the modelling. Yep. He's telling us Mick, wasn't he? Yeah, he's still doing the modelling. When I'm here with you guys, because I just keep joining in, don't I? You can join in. You just, you just <laughs> in the background. Carly Stallam's eventually got here. Oh, here Kenny, you can. Stallam, oh, everybody. It's past nine. <laughs> Hope you're well. Carly done the Debbie for the feeds. Fantastic jobs. And all of our social media. The social media, yeah. Not missed, though, is she? We carried on. Well, we're just taking a knee. <laughs> Just joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Well, we're just taking a knee off our name and replace her with Curly, Curly Perry. Curly Perry on, on photographs today.
Kenny the dad, the big tail centre forward who used to shout at everyone for me. Who's the big tall centre forward? Oh, that's you, Charlie. Charlie, <laughs> we were talking about man of the uh, player of the season, and somebody's nominated you. Yeah, yeah. You said the big, the big tall centre forward who used to shout at everyone for me. <laughs> Get Charlie's reaction. You're still, I think you're still second top scorer. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> Ball in. Oh, cleared. Yeah, I was looking at it the other night. I think you got ten. You got ten and five. Yeah, they didn't add the count count. So it's 11 and 5. Yeah, you're second. Yeah, I think I'm top scorer. Casey's first, isn't he? Casey, yeah, I think he must be now. Yeah, he's sneaking up. Do you know what I was thinking about on the way here? Well, you're saying Carter, are you? George Michael. Archie. Oh. He's on, he's on 9 in 12. Uh, yeah, but he's still not second. Where is Archie? He hasn't been for ages. Archie, are you watching this? Where have you been? He's got a new job, apparently. Right, we're over the 50. We've got 53 people watching. Here's Big Sam coming out now. Swing! Ooh! Ooh he's... He, the man was there thinking about, can we kick this ball from the halfway line over that head? And realised he couldn't. So he didn't. You say couldn't? He couldn't. So he didn't. I can hardly breathe anymore. So, Carly Stalin, what was your favourite part of the season? Tell us. What was your most enjoyable part of the season? Anybody else actually watching? Now that we're coming towards the end of the season, let us know what your favourite bit has been, or your best goal, or best moment, shall we say. Touch, Kendall. Ball out. Well in trial, we'd start to slow in the second half, yep, isn't it? standard. I'd like us to step it up and just put these there, just bury them. What was for Kenny's next message? Like this one. Half the people watching, there is accounts. <laughs> <laughs> All the little names. All the little names. You can't, it's about 2% of them you got us on. But Brad has clips one out this side to Kendall. What's... Oh, he's still winning. He's still Strength winning. Strength in there. Oh, yes. He's drawn a foul there. Well done, foul, Kendall. He's won that. He's still there, isn't he? Yeah, I think he's done his knee, has he? He called for a physio, but we haven't got a physio. And Mrs. Vic. Eddington, just for you, yeah. we're going to have Lemo running across yeah. the pitch. So Vicky Vaseline's about to come sliding on. Here he comes, look at him. He's like that Rhinestone cowboy. You can see the shine from the Vaseline. It's beautiful, isn't here. it? Look. It looks like bounce, it's like, like a little, it's like a, a, a black stallion. I thought my, maybe it was Maybelline at first, but she didn't want to I thought it was the Vaseline. Suzanne Fasoon, is that what it's called? <laughs> Suzanne. Suzanne Fasoon. <laughs> Fidel Sassoon. <laughs> Susan Fasoon. Suzanne Fasoon. That's his auntie. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing myself on the names now. <laughs> <laughs> No, not you. Suzanne for sale. The hair product. <laughs> Kylie Stallum says the top in the whole game was still her favourite. That was a great game. So basically they've just poured water all over Kendall's leg. Is that the fix? Kendy the dad. It hasn't, it hasn't worked. Look at Kendy the dad re reminiscing on his old. I tell you what, the, um, the first one was a good one. Which one? Uh, Kendall's not looking good. Leaking poo, Anita. <laughs> I'm going to put them on the screen so other people can enjoy. So he done this with these ones, did he? Leaking poo, Anita aired one, jacked off, and loser. <laughs> yeah, I'll put my hands up. I got, I got that way all them. Mengi, oh, Mengi came off, hang on. The other one was, what was it? Eileen Ulick. Oh, Kendall's not looking good, is he? Sue, so go down there and see if he's all right, will you? Well, Jonathan Mengi. Ace Parker on, well played, Mengi. What's happening with Kendall? There's no atmosphere here tonight. Uh, I suppose... <laughs> Who's coming on for Kendall then? Kendall looks like he's not coming back on. Is it going to be, uh, going to be Josh Poikeman? Yeah, Josh is, Josh is warming up. Or Joel Mason. Could be, yeah. Big ball in. Comes 25 yards out to Scott Bridges, puts one straight oh, back in the box. Oh, lovely ball. Devontae Sims couldn't get it under control straight away, but he's got it back by the 
Byline back uh, to Carter. Like grace of God. Carter, nice turn. Outside, inside. Oh, oh to the nut. And defender who's it clear. This ace versus the danger man. Oh, yeah, ace. Good luck, man. Oh, Sam looked to come for that one. Oh, look at it. Look who's back there. Will McNeil, everybody. What a shift that lad's putting in. Oh, been he's done not, there, though. Yeah, he's not a defender. Oh, bloody hell, Will. Where did we get oh, this good Will McNeil from? He's absolutely useless. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Michael Ishwood says need to get Will involved. We just did. <laughs> it's been hor it was horrific. <laughs> uh, nothing down the side so far this half. Yeah, get him off. <laughs> Will McNeil has to go. <laughs> oh, he cross. Uh, Conrad, you know, see, I'm gonna get the header on there. Is he a defender? Yeah, goal yeah, kick. Still going, uh, he forgot Dave loves, loves wood. That was oh, yeah. the other day. <laughs> You fell for that one. Is he back on? Who? Kendall. Oh, is he? Oh, he's back on. <laughs> Shall I say that? Good old Kendall. Way? No. <laughs> it's not professional to say anything to the players once they're playing. Come on, Kendall, stop doing the sack of him. Yeah, Keely says she can't see the screen. Got comments up. Yeah, I left, I left Kenny coming off for ages. Apologies, Keely. We need a media meeting. James is <laughs> James is multitasking again. Kilroy out. Kilroy Casey. Oh, James. James, James good battle in there. Managed to scoop it out for Kendall. Oh, right. Lands back to James Potter. What can do with this? Clips a lovely ball over the top for Devonte, but just too much on it. Through to the keeper. Plays it out early. Oh, poor touch. That's what still picks it up. Yeah, works out all right. There's a loop one over the top there. Just number 10. Again. He's oh, fast, Casey, isn't he? Yeah. Casey's trying to hang it up. Ma. Poor finish, but it's a good walk go. out. Oh, oh what a tackle. Absolutely Was phenomenal that Jack tackle. Yeah. What a tackle. Roman replay. Ball across early from there, number 10. And you think, mate, he's got oh, a tap it. in. Brad has let oh, it go past. Brad, and just that's dies fantastic. Forward. Slides in to block it, put it out for a corner. Fantastic challenge. That's a score as a goal. Right, so Kendall's coming off. You don't want it though. Oh, he's going to Yeah, he's Kendall straight yeah. off. That's a shame for Saturday's game. He's done his, he's he's done his bit. So who's on for him? Josh Bikerman, is he? Josh Bikerman's so coming on. Kendall, he's picked up a knock. Well played, Kendall. Great game. Round of applause from the crowd for Kendall. Coming off. <laughs> 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 Josh, Wanker. Wanker. Yeah. Round of applause for Josh. Come on, Josh. Hey. <laughs> Bloody atmosphere here. Come on, everyone. Bloody hostile here. Right, cross it. Oh, well cleared. Will McNeil there on the ball, moves it up there to Sends the big man, Josh. <coughs> Let's go, Josh. Well done. Oh, oh, Pace of this fella. Look at this. Oh, he's done him. He's done Look the big number this. six. Oh, he's oh, nearly done the little fella. No. <laughs> oh my God. Josh looked like a giant there. Nice didn't touch he? from Will. <laughs> Sorry about the camera work there, people. I found out at half time, that little fella Finn Mahan, his job, you know in the World Cup, when they drive the, the ball out to the yeah. halfway circle, he drives that car now. <laughs> 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 They're giving Josh abuse, saying he's quicker than me. Is that Brad in the book? Curly Stallam is asking, is James an MC too? Curly Stallam, James is everything. You know it, he's told us how much he does. He does everything. <laughs> Apparently, if there's another injury, he's coming on to play right back against that little Finn. <laughs> right, what's happening here? Ricky Case. Scotty. Ah. Flick on. Ball to um, be a throw-in for AFC Welland. The fellow with the hair got a flick on that. Ricky Case, of course. Is she a Hillsbury? Taking his time. Slowing up the game. I'd like to see us just keep bashing away at these. Don't want any more injuries now, do we, for Saturday? 
I see Kenny has just asked for another James Ten Parter. I've got what's uh, in what's in my box coming up, Kenny. Probably body parts. <laughs> right, it's like, for, it's like waiting for Blake and Bad to come back. <laughs> <coughs> Right. Carter intercepts the ball oh, there, well, goes on a lovely little run, goes past two, plays it out there to Will McNeil. Will McNeil! Will McNeil. The far side, keeper, oh, oh the keeper, yeah, the keeper, just keeper got saved it. Oh, Casey, great challenge. It's a Jack Reelish look about Will McNeil, isn't it? Socks around the ankles. <laughs> Right, up to Pikerman. Casey playing right back now. Oh, well done, Josh, inside out. Oh, good challenge. Poor troll, Thomas. Yeah, slipped out of his hands there, but... Do we think there's no well chance done, going to score for them tonight? I mean... <laughs> yes or no? Not really, yes. Yes, I know. No. Dave got the authority. You got a bit of authority, though. Yes, I know. James Potton. The Will McNeil. Will Carter again, up and down. Early one. I want to see Carter Josh. Fair play, I do. He's got a bit of space there in the middle of the park now they're getting. We're starting to lose a bit of shape. And number nine running at them. Oh, tries to slot one there. Oh. Well, well done, Carter. Carter was just being up crossing the ball in the other hand. The other end is back defending. And of course, he stays on the ground. This could be. I'm hoping it's not an injury. I'm hoping it's clever just to give us a chance to get a breather and a. I think he needs a break. Bit of a reset. Uh, what's happening in the games? Do you know games? Uh, Bart Dartman? No, Not in the night. No, it was yeah. Oh, Is it? Four what are we doing here? No, actually, sorry. Yeah. Four all. Is it? Oh, man. Who else is playing tonight? It's fine. Uh, Cannington. Caddington won. Caddington won uh, for a wood or something. What, they were down to nine I'm sure was somebody put in the comments, Caddington. I think hey, he won for a good block. Really? Clears it up top, but just goes out for a throw. For Stoney Stratford. Against Ainsbury, I think it was. This this number day. 10 has been everywhere on he's this good, pitch. He's but he's t had it taken off him by Scott Bridges. He's not giving up on him, though, but Bridges, well done. Bridges has got so much experience. Yeah, takes, try, just taking the sting out of it a little bit. Casey to Bridges. Oh, he's put it into the middle there to James Potton. To Ace Bark, who pops one out to the far side for Will McNeil to he's run onto. That. Is he going to keep that, that in? Yeah, he's got that lovely. Oh, unlucky. Linus Flag's oh. got that, but... Almost thought he was through again, then. I've said it in the first half, the mix of experience and youth on this team now is... Got a nice like, balance, is, haven't we? Uh, yeah, it's the balance. Both European Cup matches are uh, for all. It could be penalties. As I say that now, we are, our watchers go down from 42 to 6. <laughs> well, Stoney now tries to play a ball in oh. behind. Oh, he's... Brothers, Damn ass. Oh, what happened there? Yeah. <laughs> he was going for a tumble. He thought he'd try and take Tamas with him. Oh, Tamas is... Oh, this is not good. Ankle. Tamas has hurt himself. There goes Saturday showing off that latest swimwear. He ain't down that catwalk, is he? Oh, no. We, we've had an amendment to the Caddington score. Someone's... 3-1, Yeah. Someone entered 6-1 to them, but now it's been amended to 3-1 to Aston Clinton. Is that coffee for me? No, it's for James. No, it's for me. So just punch him in the nose. Can you bring the dog next time? It's the only reason we came. <laughs> <laughs> what did he say about? Bring the dog next time. It's the only reason we came. Um, I hope he had to pay in, did he? I don't know. I'm just going to give me a coffee, will you? No, I'm not going Charlie to. Charlie one as well. Charlie wants one. Charlie wants one. Such a bastard. 
Right, Ricky Case, right back. That's it. I said to Ricky, just just play somewhere where you're nearest to me. Yeah, gosh, should do it. <laughs> He's not even joking. <laughs> Boy, yeah, is, is that Josh Pikeman? Josh Pikeman, yeah. Oh, Josh. Oh, he's well, don't Josh. Pop, oh, too deep. There's brothers now, plenty of time on this. Let's see what you can do. This is the Carter. Carter inside to Devante. I wonder as um, do you think Devante's falling out with the family? The first game he played was about 14 of them putting on comments. <laughs> Nobody's ever mentioned them since. Miss Galatis says I need a hot toddy. I do. Do you know what it is? I had an nose operation yesterday and they've dragged me along. Kicking and screaming. I wonder, yeah, hot toddy would be nice in there, wouldn't it? You'd like anyone called Todd. Like, Hot or not? Yeah. What? <laughs> I know a neighbour. Remember him? <laughs> Toadfish. Toadfish. Is that Joel the Bobble Mason? He looked like Gleam. Joel, come on. <laughs> yeah, yeah Joel. Constitution for AFC Wellington. Carter, Hudson, Doncaster, Hull. Joel the Bobble Mason. Huh? Sorry. It's Casey, isn't it? Was it? Was it Casey? No, Casey's gone left back. Oh. Yeah, see, yeah, right. <laughs> you yeah, panicked though, James, didn't you? The MC I, has panicked. Own hand. I panicked, but I knew I was right. Michael's got a fancy tingle and everything. What? Who's What did Joel do when I said Joe the bobble? Did he react? Yeah, he started laughing. <laughs> what is the bobble mean? Kendall came off. Who came off? Did you not see a shot last Saturday? Um, yeah. Josh. Oh my god. Sorry, I hadn't put, I hadn't, I hadn't read it down. And Joe was on the floor. <coughs> Right, Tamas, who's had a very solid game tonight. Plays out to Ace Barker. Tries to play a long ball down the line to Josh, but gets caught out, playing into the centre of the park. Ah, oh, Scotty Bridges is in there well, and here's the big man, Finn. <laughs> <laughs> Stone, he plays a ball right over the right hand. So this number two, he's trying all night. He's been given that option, doesn't he? And now nothing's come of it again. Go down, son. Go down. Right, high ball from Sab. So this game has really gone quiet, hasn't it? It needs something. The crowd, yeah, just thousands here as well. It's a shame. <laughs> My camera work's got a bit flat as well. No, he's down. He's now trying to up this side for Woods. He tries to put a ball across, but hopeless pass. Goal to It's going to go out for the goal kick. No, air ball. Is a throw in? Now it's a corner. So, guys, give us something in the comments, will you? To keep us motivated. I think this game, we can honestly say, has been put to bed. You know what would be really good, James? If under the, the, the scores here, you could have the players in the minute that they score the That would be really good. The challenge. Like, also impossible with the device that we've got. <laughs> can I just have the mic? Sue has just asked me to do Sky Sports style player goal names and minutes and everything whilst operating a camera. <laughs> the step six media team they get in will be all right. He'll do it. Yeah, we'll be going to Oh, here's Kendall. Come over here, Kendall. Oh, that's sad. Well done. <coughs> We'd be all right for Saturday, Kendall. Ah, oh, Bridges. Bridges again. Just tied his up in that middle. He just owns that centre circle, doesn't he? Out to Braddo's. Clips one over there for... Oh, Will unlucky Will. Will. Just couldn't f keep, flight of the, keep track of the flight of the ball. 
out for a stony throw in. 75, 76 minutes gone, I've got. There you go. Susie Welsh says, Joel the Bobble Mason, that's getting views at home. She liked that. <laughs> what is Joel like at home, Susie? Tell us a little bit about Joel. Joel is a character, isn't he? Uh, is Susie related to Welshy? Hope not. <laughs> Dan Welsh. Susie, are you related to Dan Welsh? Have the same name. It's a common name. Is it? It's a fair assumption, right? If someone's got the same name to ask the question. Dave looked at me like I'd said something ridiculous. He's right. I mean, I've got the same name as my dad, and I'm related to him, so it checks out. <laughs> uh, Seamus. <laughs> it was Seamus McDonald as well, in yeah. Galway. <laughs> Right, come on, let's do something here. What is it? Four nil, is it? Three nil. Three, still okay. three. We could have, should have gone home at half time, Dave. <coughs> should have taken your sausage and gone home. I should have taken my sausage, taken Casey and gone home. Is it alright? I particularly like the way Lisa waited to see if it was cooked. Yeah. Who's drinking this? That was mine, but I forgot about it. It's gone a bit cold. Is that a substitution, substitution for, for um Did you see the numbers? Uh no. So Forty four people are watching. Thanks so very much guys. Yeah. <laughs> yes please. Well the sub came on and the throwing comes to him and you gave it away and we've got the ball if you want to announce that. Joel's on. <laughs> Joel's on. Who did Joel come on for? About five minutes ago for Carter. Oh did he? I didn't see that. There's Will McNeil. Oh, again, you got to gamble on that one. Will, you know Will's going to win that and put that ball in. <laughs> Ten minutes later, it goes Joel. <laughs> I was on liquid morphine 12 hours ago. I'll tell you that. <laughs> you say it every game. What's this is a standard uh, Monday, Dave, isn't it? I like this fella, Finn. Someone just fall off a chair. Someone fell behind us. Um, Susie doesn't think she's related to Dan, to Welshy. <laughs> Her sister is Danielle. Boy, Sylvia you're talking about this log. <laughs> well, we, who, it's not for us to gender or misgender, is it? So hang on, let's read this again. Susie Welsh says she doesn't think <laughs> she is related to Dan, but her sister is Danielle, but she assumes we're talking about a vlog. And Joel is a character. The best clip, can I say, did, any, did you see on, was it on Instagram when Joel's name got mentioned and his young fella at the television seen yeah. his name mm. in there, wasn't that fantastic? That is what shit football is all about. Who is Crouch? It might be late to the party, but who's the lad with the head bandage on? So you're as late to the party as David with the substitutions, Lewis. Well, that fella, I can tell you that fella is. That fella is Finn Mahan, and he got a headbutt off Mengi. <laughs> and before he was headbutted by Mengi, I fell over six foot one. Just, just to clear up any um, confusion, it was a clash of heads. Mengi didn't just bowl over and headbutt him. No, but they banged and heads. He definitely wasn't six foot one. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, we got a corner. Lewis is on his honeymoon in Barcelona. <laughs> Hurrah! <laughs> Can I just say Lewis is on his honeymoon in Barcelona watching this year. He was on the day he was getting married. He was watching us play against Ainsbury. It's the power of the AFC Welling. Ball in. Oh, Leo. That's commitment from Lewis Croucher. That's why he's getting the big money, guys. That's why he is on the big money. That's why I said it won't last. Well, we might get invited to his next win. Yeah. Some of these lads will be getting married too now. I wonder all the wags will be here, won't they? All oh, that's yeah. step five wags, step six wags. Oh, look, Lewis has had a message hidden because it's a bit offensive. <laughs> oh, has he? Look, we can either show it or hide it. I'm going to show it. Oh, there's a ball through. Is he onside? Brad is, Brad is covering. Oh, what a turn. Do you know how much I'm fucking... I'm gone. I thought Brandis was through on goal there for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gone. I need to yeah. go and lie down. Satellite delay for uh, Dave. What's that Dave. the drugs don't work anymore? Where should we go, Josh? Oh, well done, Devante. Well played. Oh, that's nice football, Ace. Right, and there's another one down. It's been very stop stop yeah. there this half, hasn't it? Yeah. Hey, 
Who is that? That is number 11, Jack Smith. Physios must hate that, look. He just started running and got halfway over and the player stood up and said, don't worry about it. It's still coming. So what have we come up? It's to throw with the Welland, is it? Yeah, yeah, they're just making an, uh, another change quick. Stoney, just that player's going off there. So Susie, can you give us a uh, Joel story, please? He is new to the club. Let's, let's find out a bit more about the, the man himself. Well, this fella's running through. Mm. Was that Casey there with them yeah. early, didn't he? Oh, Will oh, McNeil, ball lovely found, ball. Found Devontae in the middle. He's put, oh, it's a heavy patch there. Still ball. got his work boots on. Good runner from Joel. Joel was never going to get there. Gary Kitchen saying there that the physio is that lad's dad. He's going to cop it when he gets home. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the ball. Devontae. We've done ace. No, oh, great touch from Scott Bridges. Oh, yeah, that was lovely. Touch on the turn. Well, Scott is just showing his class, isn't yeah. he? He has come with a big reputation, Lloyd. Mm. Yeah, he's got better and better each week. I know uh, he was disappointed with his first performance, wasn't he? Yeah. It looks too easy for him. I'm trying to think, what position are we going to play, lads? Well, we've got this wrapped up, we've been promised a game, haven't we? We are going to play off front. <laughs> I can see you there, you and you and Casey at the back, <laughs> smooch off together. <laughs> I don't think Sam's had a save to make in this match, has he? He had one, one save like in the first half. Oh he? yeah, yeah. Towards the end, I do like it when Sam makes a good save. Go on, Josh, you got that. Well done, Josh. Play coming. Ah, oh. don't tell me, Joel, it bubbled. Oh, Joe, that actually did bubble, that one. I'm to say it every time I see Joel on the ball. Go Joel. Joel back to Scott. Deeply dippy. Oh. Oh. It's bouncing everywhere here. Scott Bridges on the scampering back look. He's done well there to slow it down. Here's Out the, the danger man, but... The danger man's done up this half. Well, I would you, to be fair, he hasn't, had, he hasn't had any chances at all. And what he has created, he's created himself. Really yeah. Have you got any more mints there, have you? He's worked hard, hasn't he, the number 10. I, I feel you. sorry for him. Well, not that much. Obviously, yeah, I want us to win. I don't feel too sorry. <laughs> it's easy to feel sorry for somebody to free up. So that's got you going to the book, is he? That's harsh. Ah, come on, will you? <laughs> that's a guy. <laughs> I was pinged at him. Max is a new friend. Comes the old truth. Tea's ringing, hang on. Hello, Mr. T. Okay, well, put it in. Yeah, let's know. Okay, nice one. Okay. Yes, boss. Instructions for the boss on the dugout. It's been brilliant, but Scott in the middle has been brilliant. It. Oh, that was unbelievable, wasn't it? I'll put it out, I'll let you know. Right. Oh, okay. So, a manager, a message from the owner of the club, said the half, the coach. He's asked for people on the comments to let us know who your man of the match is and we'll announce it over. Well, James will announce it over his PR. So, guys, let us know who you think is the man of the match, please. Lee Bennington. The manager's put in, will man... Will man please, lol. What? Man of the match. Will man of match, please, lol. They thought it would let him crown a shout out to someone's mum. I tell you, say, Will Mom, please, lol. 
Right, comment Great in. ball from Ace. Get your comments in, guys. Man of the match, please. How long is left? We've got three minutes plus injury time. Okay, yeah. Get your comments in quick, guys. Lewis Croucher, Will McNeil. Lee Mennington, Will McNeil. Who else, guys? Should we ask the fans as well? Should we get them all to tune into the YouTube? Next time the ball goes out. we got two for Will McNeil. Oh, great turn. <laughs> Go on. <sighs> Right, we've got two for Will McNeil. We've got 37 people watching. Guys, come on, man of the match, please. Who do you think? We've got two minutes. Ask Will's parents. Kendall, who's your man of the match? <laughs> Apart from you. Kendall says Kendall. Yeah. As we get into the last few minutes of this game, we're looking for the crowd to let us know who their man of the match is, excluding Will's mum and dad. They're not allowed to vote, obviously. Uh, but if you want to tune into YouTube and get a comment on the game on YouTube and let us know who you think your man of the match is, that would be appreciated. Right. There you go. We've got Lewis Croucher says they're number 12. <laughs> Bradley Watson. That's right, Lewis. That's right. Oh, Finn, somebody got Finn. I go for Finn as well. I thought he was grey. Right, man of the match no. is Finn. Can you announce that? Hey, do not use the tannoy. What? Ed wants to use the tannoy. No. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. ball over here now to Ace. Oh, watch it. Watch it. Watch it. Watch it. You almost lost the whole equipment, eh? Donna says Will. Rich James says Will by a mile. Michael Isherwood says Will. So I think we've got it, guys. I think it's Ace yeah. Barker. <laughs> it's that big tenor forward who shouts a lot. Yeah. <laughs> right, I think you can uh, announce it on 90, Jimmy. You can't announce it when no whistle blows, no? And okay. Do you know what you're going to say? I'm going to say by unanimous decision. Lewis Croucher says, no bias, David, I. Excuse me, I think Will McNeil has been fantastic. I got Will. Yeah. Danny Powell says, Will McNeil. David McNeil says, Will McNeil. John McNeil says, Will McNeil. Yeah. Will McNeil probably says, Will McNeil. Well, there is only one, isn't it? He's been fantastic. Yeah. Big shout out to the great Scotty in the middle. From, great touch from Joel. Little Finn scampering back there. Both of them take each other out. Oh, you guys. There's Big Sam now. Desperate for one goal. Right. I can't out too easy. James Potton tracking back. Gets it up to Joel. Oh, to Josh Pikeman. But Finn gets his little tackle in. Hey. Gets a little tackle in, I should uh. say. Enough sausage jokes from you, Lewis says his favourite player is Will McNeil. <laughs> right. The ball's been overplayed played touch, three times turn. since you said you were going to announce it, James. Devontae down to Josh. Now, oh, well done, Josh. Josh will never give up. He's injured. The ball's out of play. Over to you, Do James. Now. Do it now, James. Yes, 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 yes. And by unanimous decision on the comments of YouTube, I can't say that word, Will McNeil gets man of the match for the second game in a row. Big cheer for Will McNeil. Roy right, Bridges, who's had a good game as well. <laughs> um, right, the game. We can, let's just talk about the first half. Mm -hmm. Second half's been dead. Dead as a dog, though. First half, we were fantastic, I think. Yeah. Absolutely solid first half. And second half, we've not had to do a great deal. Just keep the ball and play it about. And just see the three points. Let's see it through, pick up the three points, go into the game at the weekend. And look to get promotion. We get a game that we win on Saturday, we I get think, promoted. Mm -hmm. We go up, guys, so get yourselves up to where we're playing away to Connecticut on Saturday. Can you, yeah, can you look at the league and double check the stats? Or can I no, it is, yeah. If we yeah, beat Connecticut, Lee, we've only. Yeah, Liam said six, six points in this game. Oh, yeah, like, beat Connecticut, we yeah. go up, yeah. but we still obviously have to keep going to go up as champions because Bovingdon are on our ass. Yep. 
Oh. oh. That'll make the highlight reel. Great strike. Oh, Solid again from Sam. Sam. Just to remind us that Sam's still there. Yeah. yeah. Shot fizzed in there, but Sam, no danger, catches it well. Ricky Case has gone to finish the game a left back. So he's had three positions so far, doesn't he, Ricky? Yeah. No, I just think he's. Um, yeah, they just changed it, I think, to accommodate Joel. <laughs> Come on, Joel, give us one. Oh, ace. Ah, ace. Ace. Gotta go back to bed. Come on, Sam, do something, lad. There's a three now, gonna have a shot from 40 yards. No, nothing there. And that has been the start of the game, yeah. really. They yeah, haven't shown a lot going forwards. <laughs> Lewis Crouch, I'll see you Saturday, boys, back on Friday night. Enjoy yes, the rest Lewis. of your um, honeymoon, Lou. Lou? A bit familiar, isn't it? Yeah, with the players. Hey, Lou. What's Casey going to say? Casey's fine. Love you, Lou. Yeah, see you, see you Saturday, Lewis. Have a great time. That's a load. I've never been there. It's a nice. I'll go there in September. I don't even know if he's in, but I can't remember. Me and William Galamez. Tease asked me to go over and speak to. Is it Will Galamez? The William Galamez, the Spanish commentator. William Balagay. Yeah. Yeah. He says if he can come over, then uh, he wants to see if we can make him an offer. He can't refuse. I speak Spanish, so I'm going over to see him. Make Case jealous. He doesn't want to get involved in that love triangle. <laughs> Case ain't a jealous type. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brothers. There we go. Beats it off the 17. The new lad's just come on there and he's got go. one in the Full back. There we go. Full time. Poor old 17, he's just come on the pitch and got raspy a, a belt of a shot there and he's getting <laughs> carried out. That's the their first shot on target, isn't it? Yeah. Kendall, see you later. Goals from Kendall, Atticle Alfie and Levante Tins. Thank you to Stony Stratford for travelling tonight. You acquitted yourself very well. Just didn't go your way in the second half there. Big shout out to Finn, my player of the match. Well played, Finn. And thank you to the 2,000 people that made it to the game tonight. I don't have the official gate, so I'm just guessing. Thanks for bringing the weather with you, everybody. And the big news is we now sit three points away from a short promotion in our first season. Big cheer for the Romans, everybody. Before you leave. Black <laughs> Charlie, you're with the biggest cheer there. Yes! Yeah. I'm going. Right. Right, I'm going. Right, okay, we'll all go too then. No, all right, well, wait, I'll wait what? 10 minutes. Huh? 10 minutes, I'm not drinking though, I need to get in the morning. Okay, give us 10 minutes. Are you guys, 10 having, minutes. The, are you guys having a matrimonial on, on the live stream? Sorry about this, ladies and gentlemen, oh, if yes. you're still listening. Hello! <laughs> Sorry. Right, good. Um, Miss Glass, good clean sheet for Sam again. Sam has been fantastic. Mind you, I could have played in goal tonight, and they've only, we would have only conceded two. Uh, oh, Josh Grantham, everybody, best player at step seven, Will McNeil. Good old Josh, how are you? Oh, hi, Josh. I miss you, Josh. We miss you, Josh. Um, so, yeah, that's the crack, isn't it, guys? Happy with that? Wanna, yeah, wanna it's time to sign off, is it? Pretty much, pretty much. Hey, look at him, my nose looks like it's taking a left hand turn there, everybody in the ear. Okay, guys, listen, thanks very much for tuning in. Um, our regulars, Mr. Galatis, Lewis Croucher, Josh Grantham, Danny Powell, Donna, Dara, Emma, Paul, Lee Merrington, Gary Kitchen. Lee Merrington, he's the manager. Is he still going? Oh, yeah, he yeah. put it. Lee, I think Dave's so, just, he's just going off on one of Susie Welsh has gone off now to go through her um, family tree to see if they're related to Dan Welsh. Josh is Dan Welsh, Josh Daniel Grantham, Welsh. Uh, Come down to the come to the Codigat game, Josh, uh, Saturday. Yeah. Yeah, get down there on Saturday, guys. We'll all have a good drink after the game. Yeah, Josh, get down to the to the match because you uh Josh Grantham provided so much good stuff 
for us on and off the field, Josh. So if we do go up, it'll be down to you as well, mate. Be good to see you, Josh. Okay, listen, well, can we go? Yeah. Yeah, you can go. Cheers, everybody. We'll see you Saturday. See you later, Thanks very guys. much, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Good luck. Look at you two. Your nose is killing me, though.